Yeah, what's good, bro? Okay, you be back with another recipe. No, okay, today we got a, an old man's advice, bro. Now, old, you know what I'm saying? Old guys normally got good advice, you know what I'm saying? A lot of times, you know what I'm saying? So, fuck around, you know what I'm saying? You might learn some shit, bro. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We're going to share the video. No cap, bro. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Whoops. It's raining. Hold on a minute. All right, bro. There. Having too much fun with this technology, I bro. I thought I'd talk to you a little bit this morning about, uh, oh, by the way, this is a new computer. and Okay. It does all kinds of things, so I have to be careful. Okay, Gramps. Uh, I'm not the sharpest tack in the box when it comes to this new equipment. You're talking to a guy or a guy is speaking to you now that started driving a Model A car. I remember the first jet airplane and many. Oh, the shit, things. the fuck? The Iceman delivering ice to an ice box, taking it off of a mule-drawn wagon. So... But I'd like to speak shit. to you a little bit of this morning about uh, young people in particular. I'm young. About accomplishing things. Okay. When I was young, as you know, I had a difficult childhood. But there's no excuse for people not being able to do what they want to do. You can do anything that you want to do. But. For example... As I've told you before, I lived in the back of an old car. I taught myself to read and write. Damn, okay. So if you're young, don't give up. Don't say the world is just against me. That's not true. I taught myself to read and write. I've had five books published. Okay. I went to, to college, uh, got a little bit of college. I've studied scripture for many, many years. I've raised five children. Mm -hmm. I buried a mother, father, sister, brother, mm -hmm. wife, and daughter. Damn, you said buried? So a person can accomplish everything. anything that they want. One time to prove to myself that I was not an ignorant person, I bought a blackboard. And I purchased a correspondence course for computer programming and I completed it with the blackboard. So, <clears throat> forge ahead. Don't stop. Never stop learning. Always reach out to better yourself because when you do that, but. <laughs> things expand. You understand more. You're happier. You're healthier. This old saying that if you don't use it, you lose it, is absolutely true. If you don't use that brain that God put in your head, mm -hmm. one of these days you'll be sitting on a front porch somewhere and you won't hardly know what's going on so don't don't give up if times are hard good things nor bad things last forever but most generally we are in control of our own destiny that's and when I say that I mean this what you mean by if you're not getting ahead, you need to do something to allow yourself to get ahead. <clears throat> for an example, <clears throat> excuse me, for an example, if, if you want a good job, if you want a secure future, you have to have something to offer a prospective employer. Now, I'm not saying you need a PhD or a master's degree. But you do have to have something to offer. There's going to be a time in this country that people that know how to work with their hands, plumbers, electricians, carpenters, cement layers, machine operators, mechanics, people that know how to work with their hands are going to be in great demand. Thanks. Yes, it's true. You have to have I think that's right now. And training to be an engineer or a doctor or a lawyer. But I'll tell you the truth. 
I spent 60 years working. I was successful. I started a couple of businesses. I'm not uh, see, me, but I don't find working 60 years fucking successful to me, bro. Like, nigga, I, nigga, successful to me is retiring after like a cool 10 years of working, nigga. I want to be making so much money to where, like, nigga, I worked for a cool 10 years of my life, bro. You know what I'm saying? 10 years of my adulthood, and then just I'm set for the rest of my life. So obviously, you know what I'm saying? Still be making money and shit, but like, I want to have my money making, you know what I'm saying? My money working for me, nigga. It's like 10 years from now, I'll be how old, bro? But to touch 30, nigga. I mean, 20. I'm, yeah, 30, nigga. I'm about to be touching 30, nigga. Fuck, nigga. I'm getting old. I'm about to be I, 10 years, I'm be 28, nigga. I want to, you know what I'm saying? I have my money working for me like crazy, nigga. I want to say, be done, nigga, with this YouTube and fucking entertaining and, and content creating shit, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Still do it for fun and shit, but like, you know what I'm saying? I'm done with this shit now. I can do it at all, honestly. But I'm a guy that's so why I upload so much and shit. You know, something that happened, nigga. Except for when, you know what I'm saying? A nice Start making money off this shit. And to be able crazy. to talk to you on this thing. So I'm going to close, but I, I just wanted to, to share that with you this morning. Young people, I love you. I do. I, I love young people. Uh, my grandmother always said, you know, when a baby smiles, the angels sing. And that's true. I believe. But young people, you're the backbone of this country. You're the backbone of the world. I don't care if you're in Asia, Africa, Korea, Japan. I don't care where you are, the United States. You are the leaders, the future leaders of this world. Facts. So reach out. Be yourselves. Don't be afraid to, 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 to go after what you need. So I love you. Have a great day. And you I'll too. see you tomorrow. Alright, you know what I'm saying? Hey, w reaction, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you like, comment, subscribe.